Bike theft. It's a crime that's plagued Provo for years, and it's getting worse as the weather starts to warm up. 11 News reporter Roger Sanchez spoke to Provo police about what steps they are taking and what you can do to prevent this from happening. Provo police say bicycle thefts have increased in the past month, and the number of stolen bike reports has jumped more than 35 percent from February to March and it continues as it starts to get warmer. When we're looking at our top five crimes, the one that probably goes up the most for us is our bike thefts. And we think that probably one of the reasons this happens is that it's warmer, there's more people outside. Bicycle theft may seem to be a small crime in the grand scheme of things, but they have a huge impact on a victim's life. Police are asking Provo City residents to become a hard target for these predators looking for a steal. I honestly thought it was the last person. I was the last person this was going to happen to. Police recommend to always lock your bike if you leave it unattended, even if it's for a minute, and to register your bike with Provo City for your benefit and because it's the law. It also is a tool if we find the bicycles left abandoned uh, to have contact information to get those bikes back to the registered owners. Thieves are always to blame, but police say some bike owners often make a thief's work pretty easy. Police suggest to use tight U-locks like this one whenever you lock your bike. Police say if you have a lost or stolen bicycle and you have reported it stolen, you may view the bikes at the police department. In Provo, Roger Sanchez, 11 News. Licensing your bike is easy. You can license your bike for only $1 with Provo City. To know more about this story and how to license your bike, visit our website, 11news.byu.edu.